Fact number six, hot water can freeze faster than cold water. The Mpemba effect is a phenomenon in which hot water can freeze faster than cold water under certain conditions. This effect was first observed by the Tanzanian student Erasto Mpemba in the 1960s, and it's been the subject of scientific study and debate ever since. The Mpemba effect has been demonstrated under certain conditions, but it's not a universal phenomenon, and it does not always occur. In general, the freezing time of water will depend on a variety of factors, including the initial temperature of the water, the size and the shape of the container, and the presence of any dissolved substances or impurities in the water. The exact mechanism behind the Mpemba effect is not fully understood, and there are a few different theories that have been proposed to explain it. One theory is that hot water can evaporate more quickly than cold water, which removes some of the heat from the water and allows it to cool more quickly. Another theory is that hot water might contain more dissolved gas microbubbles, which can remain suspended as the water cools and accelerate the freezing process. Despite the Mpemba effect's apparent counterintuitive nature, it's been demonstrated in a number of scientific studies and has been reproduced in the laboratory. However, further research is needed to fully understand the underlying cause of this phenomenon. Now, personally, I find the Mpemba effect extremely interesting. All right, the common sense would tell you that if an object, uh, a bucket of water is already cold, and you have another second bucket of water that's warmer, and you put them both in the freezer, that uh, the bucket of water that has the cold water should freeze faster than the bucket of water that has the hot water. But sometimes that does not happen. And again, as I said, it's not always reproducible. It has been reproduced in the lab, but only under certain conditions, and it's a poorly understood effect. Learn anything at mathandscience.com.